The most important messages that our classroom teachers need to understand is how vital they are in producing and implementing a new English syllabus, one that reflects their experience, professionalism and their ability to prepare students for the next generation within schools. My initial thoughts about the draft K-10 English syllabus are that it does reflect the work that the English Board Curriculum Committee has undertaken over the last uh, year or so. Um, the content statements from ACARA were unsatisfactory uh, for the development of a curriculum and the Board endorsed the English Board Curriculum Committee's decision uh, to say that they're unsatisfactory. So we've seen a fair bit of progress uh, in the draft document that's just been released that shows the, um, uh, the work uh, of the board uh, that the Board of Studies has undertaken to, to modify some of that content to make it more palatable and, and more useful for, for teachers in New South Wales. We've worked hard to ensure that we have produced a document that teachers can look at and comment on. It's vital that teachers do take the opportunities to consult through the local meetings that have been provided by the board and more importantly with the online consultation. The surveys that are there, we need all their re responses and their advice to give us the uh, information we need to try and produce a workable, effective document. The, the key thing at the moment is that the, uh, the draft English syllabus K-10 is out for, for consultation with the board at the moment. It's, it's vital that teachers take the opportunity to get involved with um, reading the document very closely, considering what the implications may be for their, for their practice and giving that feedback to the board. And whether it's through the board's um, consultation processes, that is the question there that they've got online or meetings that they've got open at the moment, or whether it's actually writing their own response, and in some ways that might be more valuable because they're not shaped by what the board's asking about readability and so forth with the document. Um, it's very useful for our members to be saying whether they think the content of the syllabus is useful for them as teachers and if it's the, the best document that could be produced for their students. The consultation's open now and teachers should go immediately to the board's site and find the various consultation uh, meetings and the s survey that's available there. The period finishes in early September so that we can gather the information that is gleaned through that consultation and hopefully we'll get to a second round of consultation where they'll see the results of their input.